Well, they can be eye-catching and tempting, but if you purchase something from a TV infomercial, you need to listen to the pitch very carefully. Call for Action's Keith King is here to explain why. Keith? Good evening, Mark. Those TV infomercials can be tough to resist, but before you pick up the phone and order, listen to what happened to one woman when she bought what she thought was a good deal. Betty Crozier ordered a new swivel sweeper after seeing a TV infomercial, and she loves it. What she doesn't love is what showed up on her credit card. Call now and get the cordless swivel sweeper with battery and charger for just two payments of $19.99. Crozier says she ordered after they threw in a second swivel sweeper for free. Buy one, get one free. So I thought this is a deal. But when she called, she says she got a computer that would not let her quickly order a sweeper. It took a good 20 minutes to answer every question. And you had to be careful of what you said, or you could buy all this extra stuff. Exasperated, she finally ordered just the sweepers, but they arrived with a bill for $69. That's far more than she expected. I was shocked that they charged me $29.98 for shipping. The swivel sweepers manufacturer Ontel did nothing wrong, but its fine print is so tricky that online complaint forms are filled with complaints similar to Betty's. The pitch? Buy one, get one free for two payments of $19.99. That's nearly $40 plus postage and handling. That's an extra $15 per sweeper. Total, just under 70 bucks. Betty says the next time she'll look for one at Walmart or Bed Bath & Beyond with no shipping charges. Swivel Sweepers manufacturer in an email explains the shipping fees and confirms that all of them are written out in the fine print. So the best advice, be sure to ask a lot of questions when ordering any TV product. If you want to be in the loop with the latest scams and money-saving tips, follow me on Twitter for the updates throughout the day. You can find me at Keith King NKC. For Call for Action, I'm Keith King.